Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to the heart of Texas and the very wonderful AT&T Stadium in Arlington. Straight ahead, we've got a good one on tap here between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Dallas Cowboys. Brett Maher has this one teed up, and we are underway here at AT&T Stadium. And here comes a return from the middle of the end zone. Oh, a good-looking return set up here. There he goes, right side. He will score. Touchdown, Bengals. So how about that? You want to talk about coming into a hostile environment and just silencing the crowd. They just did it. Couldn't be a better start. There's no way. All week long, they've talked about having this type of a start, but I think they looked at it from the offensive team's perspective. You know, get the opening kickoff. You guys control the ball. A lot of people are now going to say, okay, now your offense, will they be out of whack? No, not at all. They're going to be absolutely happy. They're relaxed. They took care of business for them. They don't have any pressure now. They can just go play. They'll send a receiver in motion to the right. They'll start the drive with Elliott. And some room to maneuver. Ezekiel Elliott going to take it the distance. Touchdown, Cowboys. That's a great response. You give up the first score of the game, but you go right down yourselves and get the equalizer. I just had a flashback there. I remember playing in a game like that in college where one of my teammates had said in the media that week, the opposite team would be lucky to cross our goal line. They crossed it in the first minute of the game. On our first offensive play, we scored to answer back. Something similar to what we just saw there. Very similar to what we just saw. Following the touchdown, here's Marr to kick it away. They'll elect to bring it out here from the end zone. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. Burrow and the Bengals with a first and 10 right at the 30. 11, 11, 11. They'll try and start this drive in the air. Man open, that's Jamar Chase complete. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. A good pick up there, a 22. I don't care who you put on him. He's going to be a handful in one-on-one -on -one throws. Yeah, right now, you're right. They're in man-to-man, -man, maybe need some safety help. I would say that'd be a good idea. Double-team him somehow. Go. I'm going to have to make someone else beat me rather than let him shred my defense. 11 mighty. 11 mighty. Burrow going to fake to mix it and now look to throw. It's caught inside the 25. And he will take it on in for a Bengals touchdown. Jamar Chase, 47 yards. And the Bengals are able to move back in front. Extra point by McPherson, up and good. And that makes this a 14-8 ball game. After the touchdown, McPherson on to kick this one away. Well, from deep in the end zone, he's going to bring this out. And he'll be brought down shy of the 20, so the decision to bring it out of the end zone, not a good one. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Well, partner, you know, coaches always say that every play is designed to score a touchdown. Sometimes that's not really true, but last drive, that was the case. One play to get into the end zone, and now they'll try to duplicate that success here. And it's rare for those. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off by Von Bell. And the Bengalsons are going to take over at their own 28-yard line. 
Well, he exited the pocket trying to improvise. That was a tough throw, and unfortunately, it wound up in the wrong pair of hands. And Brandon, when you're on the run, sometimes your downfield vision can get skewed just a bit. Now, the beauty of extending a play is sometimes your receivers find their way open, but oftentimes you end up closing down part of the field and bringing those defenders to the ball. And that one was picked off. A big play there on the catch and run. 69 yards. I don't think there's anyone who could possibly doubt how fast he could run in the open field. But if there were, he silenced those thoughts there. Mixon going to be hit and met at the line of scrimmage. They get him down at the three. They'll go again from the three here on second and goal. From the shotgun, it's Burrow. That's to Chase. He's got it. Touchdown, Cincinnati. Jamar Chase with his second touchdown in this opening quarter. And they are able to add on to their advantage. Extra point by McPherson, up and good. And that makes it 21-8. to eight. After the touchdown, McPherson on to kick this one away. This will be brought out from the middle of the end zone. And he'll be brought down shy of the 20, so the decision to bring it out of the end zone, not a good one. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And for this offense, Charles, you got to think kind of crucial here to put something together on this drive because remember last time out, they threw the interception on the very first play. And you can't afford to let this defense keep building any more momentum. They're playing awfully well, and they're awfully confident right now. To me, it's time to take it right down Broadway. The 30, 10, touchdown, Cowboys. C.D. Lamb. An 80-yard touchdown. And the Cowboys are able to strike quickly here as they are in for six. In motion left, the tight end. Prescott, they're going to throw for it. Oh, the ball comes out on the hit, but they'll say it's incomplete. Well, split the difference, and they're right where they would have been with two PATs. They got the two-point conversion the first time. They failed there. Interesting, isn't it? Because the first time you go after your first score, that feels like a gamble. The second time when they tried it again, that felt like, what the heck, right? Because, as you said, even if you miss it, you split the difference, and you're right on schedule at 14 points. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. The Bengals drive about to get going. Well, this offense looks like they have a little extra pep in their step as they take the field here for drive number three because remember, Charles, drives one and two both ended in the end zone. Yeah, and right now they've just got to be careful not to lean into overconfidence because every drive has a life of its own. But I like the way that they've started, the way that they're going about doing things right now. They've got a chance for that third consecutive touchdown, and that would be a crushing blow to the defense. Yeah, he'll fight for a couple as the tackle is made at about the 32. Third and two, now Burrow. Oh, he'll let one go deep for Higgins. And that will be incomplete. Well, they weren't scared to let it fly, but it falls to the ground and brings up fourth down. Not a great start dropping his first target, but let's face it, it won't be his last chance because he'll get opportunities to make up for that one throughout this game. They'll try and throw forward with Burrow. He's going to go up top again. And this one is incomplete. Boy, a curious decision to go for it doesn't pan out. And Dallas, they'll take over in terrific field position. They play fake to Elliott. Now Prescott. It's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. I'll give them credit. Winning that first snap and forcing an incompletion, 
They're hoping that'll deflate the offense a little bit after they took the field charged up after taking over after a turnover. They'll send a receiver in motion to the left. On second and ten, Prescott. He'll get this out wide here to Elliott. And they'll work this down inside the 30. In danger of squandering their great field position as they come up on a third and seven. Looking to throw, Prescott. Oh, he rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. And he will bring it back. It's a pick six for a Bengals TD. Well, Charles, he was looking for just a short throw, kept it in range for the rare linebacker pick six. And give him full credit for his focus. He just kept the quarterback in his sights, and where he was looking to throw, he positioned himself perfectly to be there for the interception. He made the play of the game for his defense right there. And this is going to be returned from the middle of the end zone. And in hindsight, probably should have taken a knee as he only gets this out to the 16-yard line. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Now remember, they were just out here a moment ago through the pick six, so we'll see if they can take better care of the football this go around. And sometimes, partner, I think it's almost better that you just throw the pick six and you come right back out on the field. You're not over on the sidelines dwelling for it for very long. You're not hearing everyone say, oh, hey, you'll get them next time. Hey, don't worry about it. All that stuff just goes right out the window. You're right back out on the field with a chance to atone. They'll try and run for it with Elliott. And he's going to have the first down yardage as he's down at about the 30-yard line. Kill, kill. 47. Here we go, 46, 46. Prescott on first down. He finds his target. It's Schultz. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. So two first downs, and that moves the ball to the 42 now, first and 10. Out of the gun. Here's Prescott. And here's another interception, the third of this first quarter. Daxton Hill picks it off, and the Bengals are going to take possession of the football. First down, here's Burrow. He's got a man complete. And all the way in for a Cincinnati score. Jamar Chase doing it again with his third touchdown here in the opening quarter. And the Bengals are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Extra point by McPherson, up and good. And the lead now to three touchdowns at 21. After the touchdown, McPherson on to kick this one away. And this will be returned from deep in the end zone. And the decision to bring it out, not a good one, as he's tackled at the 15. And this will probably be the last play of the quarter. And they'll run the option to start the drive. And he's taken down, but not before. This across the 25-yard line. Start of the second quarter, and it's the Cowboys in possession as they've got it with a first and 10. They'll run the jet sweep with Brown. And he will lose yardage and be backed up to the 24. Now they contend with a second and 12 after the loss. Off play action to Elliott. Here's Prescott. And for the fourth time tonight, it's an interception. And the Bengals are going to take possession of the football. Well, these defensive coaches, they...